Okie dokie. Tape is rolling. Zoom, zoom. Quiet on the set. Getting ready to go live on the radio. Zoom Room Video Communications brought to you by the BMC. Had the oracle foretold, two idiots would misinterpret the news. Welcome to lunch with Jack and Laz show. They can't read at all. Welcome to lunch with Jack and Laz show. Where no. That's right, nobody knows. What the heck is going on? I tell you what. Greetings, everybody. This is Laz and Jack. Well, he's MIA once again. I know he's floating around someplace, but uh, he's not where he's supposed to be right now. So uh, hopefully he'll be joining us. Waldo, starting us out right today. With 200 bits on a fruck awesome Friday. Thank you very much, Waldo. And, uh, of course, that's going to get us a quote from Lazarus Long. 200 bits. And, uh, let's see. Uh, I just had one. One might define adulthood as the age at which a person learns he must die and accept his sentence undismayed. Undismayed. Yes. It's a short, quick ride, folks. So, of course, take advantage of it. Bridge Troll kicking us up with 300 bits, getting himself a mystery game key, and kicking off that first raffle in Game of Marbles here on Fruck Awesome Friday. Love you guys. Exclamation, I love free shit. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm going to just do this today, Bridge Troll. I've been wanting to do this. So I think you're going to be the recipient of the... Because uh... I got a pair of games here to give away, and uh, I, I, I hate to break them up. And it's an interesting one, so I'm going to be giving you uh, the Gianna sister Sisters Twisted Dreams. And the Gianna Sisters... Twisted Dreams Rise of the Owl Overlord. Owl, Owl Overlord. So, uh, that's going to be special today for Bridge Troll just because you're kicking us off with it. And of course, you never know what the hell's going to happen around here because, again, I've got all sorts of these and I just hate to break up these two keys. I've got them sitting here. I've got a whole bunch of other keys sitting here, but. I've been wanting to give these two out so that they're out of the way for a while. And then I'll have another pair of these keys, which I'll do it again one day. So uh, that's what uh, we're going to be giving to Bridge Troll today. And did you give me a track number yet? A track number yet? And I'm going to put these all in one 
whisper it to you. So, this is going to be two keys, two matching games. I guess it's part one and part two. Because, hey, it's Fruck Awesome Friday. He says random. Random. Let's get this random track loaded up. We're going to hit it a couple times just to make sure it's really random. There we go. And we've got On Thin Ice 2. So exclamation play on <laughs> stream. Exclamation I love free shit. Going to be clicking that start button. Give you all 69 seconds. That's right, 69 seconds. Because we never make any sexual innuendo jokes here on NBNN. Not us. And let's get this last key out to you. And there you go. Bridge Troll, thank you very much. Enjoy those uh, games. Let me know how those are. I, I don't have these actually in my collection yet, but uh, when you play it, you drop me a line one day and just say, uh, you know, liked it, disliked it. But of course, yes, you never know what's going to be happening around here on NBN, and I've gone crazy with these game keys. I love giving this shit away, and of course, love giving you guys free shit, so... Exclamation, I love free shit. Get in on the action. Ten seconds left. Only five racers today? Are you serious? Only five is? Nobody wants any scrolls anymore? <laughs> well, good luck to the five years who are in here. Who you got? Mika, Ikandis, myself, Bridge Troll, and Treasure Pile. This should be interesting. Crazy last Fridays. <laughs> I still like Fruck Awesome Fridays. This Fruck Awesome is a Fruck Awesome good guy. He conned us. Looks like he's running away with it down here. As he goes down the slide. Although, at another 200 bits. Thank you, buddy. The Condis navigating his way to the giant hamster ball. As he gets beat up, flipped up and down and around. Giving everybody a chance to catch up to him. Let's see if he drops out before everybody or is he just going to get caught up in that ball. Mika going for the full 360. Econ this finally out. Everybody else still caught up. Treasure Pile hasn't even made it to the ball yet. Econ just working his way down. Up oh, here come the rest of us. Me and my friend tries. Treasure Pile ejected. It looks like Econ this is going to be a shoe in. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Because you never know what's going to happen here in Marvels. Somebody's going to drop first, maybe? Or is Ekondis? Ekondis just took some damage. And there he goes. In for the win. <laughs> I gotta love this shit. 
And he kind of says, keeping Jack's seat warm, cheering. And I'll just go ahead and trade him. Because he's sitting right here. Makes life easy. I finally got smart and just put a whole bunch of scrolls in a bag so I don't ever have to keep digging in my inventory. Make life even easier. Congrats, Econdis, and of course, this is going to kick off the Mystery Game Key Raffle, so make sure you're all raffled up while we're making sure everybody is raffled up. Up Here comes Jack. Looks like Jack's going to make it into this show. Today, eventually, he's making his way in now. He's loading up Shroud of the Avatar. But uh, Waldo with another 200 bits, and that will kick off... Another quote, Lazarus Long. And of course, Lazarus has got loads of quotes out there. If you'd like to see some of them, buy my in-game book, The Book of Lazarus, Part 1, where uh, I have uh, many. I should probably be reading out of that book, but... Uh, <laughs> Here we go, a quote from Lazarus Long. Progress isn't made by early risers. It's made by lazy men trying to find easier ways to do something. Amen to that. Amen to that. Quotes from Lazarus Long for you guys and gals out there, because uh, Waldo tipped us 200 bits to get himself a quote. All right, so how are we all doing out there? Why is what that ticker is not... It was time for a quote from Lazarus Long. Ooh, what is no. that? What time does the show start? Yeah, I was going to say, what, yeah, what time is it? <clears throat> it's time for somebody to get a watch. It's time for somebody to actually schedule lunch. <laughs> You've seen my calendar. It's got lunch <laughs> on there. No, it's got call with client on there. Nobody falls <laughs> for call with client every day at the same exact time. Lunch, they That's understand. They lunch, they understand. <clears throat> they, they don't even understand that, so... <laughs> Uh-huh. Uh you on, I, I you on video to, I, yet? I am on video. All right. I'll get uh, you up on I screen. Do, I, do to, I do need to turn that on. <laughs> <laughs> let's, I am let's live get as Jack well. in here. Although I have no idea why two, two cameras are on right now. Oh, man. Yeah, that was another, another... Uh, uh, yeah, r r wrong cameras, gotcha. That's whatever the wrong camera. We've just got a head today. R r oh, the camera's got oh, a head. And no, it's... Oh, whoa, wait, I, I was uh, in... Yeah, okay. I, I had to do something. <laughs> there now, you the, go. The fun part is, imagine that Zoom has decided to start capturing the wrong windows again. Hate when that happens. Yeah. It's like fucking Zoom, man. Quit See, changing I've, shit. I finally got it to the point where I just turn it on and it captures us the way it's supposed to or captures you the way it's supposed to and boom. There, you know, but there anyway. was another Zoom update that uh, did weird. Oh, uh, I haven't, haven't thing, seen a new it's, one. It's actually sending us to the wrong... Uh, no? That's... Why, why the fuck's my... Screen, I don't know. Like, While you're figuring that on the side, uh, actually, I think you have a little one here, which you shouldn't have. Hold on, it, hold on. Video settings. It can be easily adjusted out. Like yeah, th th this is something that Zoom did again. Yeah. Oh, I don't know, but hope you're all raffled up. Because we're going to close out this giveaway. We're going to pick ourselves that winner. And Ekondis, holy crap, Ekondis doubling it up today. Congratulations, uh, Ekondis won the race I'm and the giveaway. Happy. Join mine. And let's see what Ekondis won himself. He won himself. Ice cold beer. Eh. Up in the frozen. He's got himself a copy of Kill to Collect. Kill to Collect. Wait. You play a you play a hit man? I don't know. Uh, Kill you, you to something. Collect. 
Yes. And I probably forgot to change my date on my stream. You think? I have no idea. <laughs> it, it's possible. I, I, what's what's the date on there? What, what what's the date? I don't know. I don't ever have yours open. I don't have any of the streams open. I just have uh, I, I, OBS. I, I don't. I don't have mine open either. I <laughs> no clue. Don't have a clue. But anyway. Oh, I did get the date correct. Good for but you. I do have a giveaway open on my stream. Yes, and the next one is now open also, so you guys know how this works. The more you tip, the more we play and give away. So that, that's how it works around here. If you don't tip, then Thank we you, just Otto. then we just give you some news. And speaking of news, you want to start off with the uh, Halloween stuff first today, or you want to start off with the uh, Twitterverse today, or? Uh, I, I clicked. What, the what, link what do you earlier. want to start off today? <laughs> Let's start off with uh, the Halloween party that is next Friday. The the first Halloween party. The first Halloween party. Yes. October the the uh, Halloween party. One's a Halloween party and one is a deco contest. And Drag Attack subbing in for seven months. Thank you very oh, much. Drag, is, we'll, we'll get it up on screen real quick. Get that Halloween party up on screen while we uh, wait for him to give us a track number. So that is Drag going Attack. to be out in Fort Titan. 23. Our our friend Tight uh, 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 Twistar is going to be hosting that party at his house. Um, it will be on Virtue Radio um, with Aline Dragonfire doing some stuff, and the Graceful Bard is going to be doing something as well. He, so he got we he's got all the top 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 ladies out there doing some entertaining yeah. for you on that Halloween party. Um, man, uh, I will say that there's a new skin on my Marbles connection. Um, oh. If if you are a subscriber, you can play uh, eleven for <laughs> eleven. The, <laughs> the name of this skin is <laughs> Vainy. Oh, I, I saw that one. I didn't think it was. Uh, <laughs> no, if you yeah. want a veiny ball, you need to be a <laughs> you subscriber. You want some balls? <laughs> Why didn't I, I think of that? I just looked at it and went, man, that's that's na that's if nasty. You, want veiny veiny ball, ball, you, you need to be a subscriber <laughs> on my stream <laughs> and do play 11. That's right. Exclamation, I love free shit on both sides. I'm going to be doing a giveaway after this. Uh, this one, thank you for the sub, and uh, thank you for the follow, Divine Killer 420. Oh, yeah, 420. Puff, yeah. puff, fast, baby. I tell you what. <clears throat> oh, man. I guess we are clicking yeah. play. We'll, we'll be hitting three, that. Two, or start, and three, two, one, start. Uh, okay, got four people in on my side so far. That yeah, we had a big, big five on the last race, and uh, we've got eight so far. Team. Exclamation yeah, play exactly. on both streams. Exclamation I love free shit. Of course, uh, mystery Two game lemons. key up for grabs. Econ, did I give you that key? Everybody yet? wants, like, Draken is like, you had me. I can't believe they actually had a ball called Vainy. Uh, yeah, you know, it's a beautiful thing. Yes. Uh, yep. It's a beautiful thing. But um, let's make sure we get this to Econdus. And if I sent it to you, well, you're getting it again just because I can't remember. <laughs> All right, getting ready to race. And we are going to be dropping down. You got an odds of one in four, or one in... Uh, Laz didn't even join in on my my side. Down you know, there. I I'm did sure. not, did I? No, you did Oops. not. And, and we've already dropped down the pegboard. Econdis is in the lead. Who's in the lead on your side? Well, it was Drac Attack until Tina slid on by, but we are now in... Uh... Passing up, let's see, who is it? Mika is now in the lead. Woohoo! Thank you, Dr. Dyaus. Dr. Dyaus. Dyaus. 
Dias. Doctor, just Doctor D. Doctor Die Ozzy. Uh, <laughs> Draken Naruto is in the lead on my side, so we are going to be falling down here. Uh, yeah, Bridge Troll. There are so many cheaters in Marvels. It's amazing. Hey, you gotta you gotta oh. polish your marbles, oh, man. You gotta oh, shot, oh, polish oh. and shave them. Th thank thank you for notifying me of that there, uh, Ikondis, that I forgot to switch screens in slobs and <laughs> showcase the marbles because Air Draken wants a or Ikondis wants a close up of his veiny ball um skin. <laughs> and <laughs> Draken ejected right at the end, but we can watch his veiny ball skin fall out of the map, which leaves Mika. And Mika doesn't. Mika does not have a veiny ball skin on my stream. Veiny ball skin. <laughs> I love this shit. <laughs> Man, I mean. It's it's like they created a ball. It, 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 it was right there in front of me, and I missed it. You know, I I, I, I looked at it, and I bought some other balls. <laughs> yeah. I bought some yeah, other ball like skins. Baney. It's like, <laughs> dude, I have to. It's like, yeah, uh, I have to. I have to. Uh, let, let, let's, let's see if I can find marbles on stream on my phone, so that way I can show everybody that the ball is indeed named a veiny well we you should be able to uh, actually just bring it up in the store once the the race ends right on what, right on the big screen shouldn't we hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I don't know but i i just finished the map uh let's see customize. yeah we're still waiting i gotta give him some scrolls here hold on if you can read that does it Say it's it's it says yeah it's, it's a little blurry but uh i'm, I'm gonna do it this way it, it, it is a veiny yeah. ball so we'll, we'll go back to the race menu and then we'll go to the balls so that way you can see it shop uh let's see uh, there it is uh, the vein veiny balls veiny. veiny balls and you can actually rotate the veiny balls so you can actually see it yeah. So, <laughs> veiny balls. <laughs> Track attack. Thank you for that post. <laughs> it's all about the veiny balls in Marvel's on stream. <laughs> but that means that we've we're done talking about Twist Star <laughs> saying uh it, until we get some more bits. We're talking about other things what what other things am i supposed to be talking about uh the the other, fantastic other yes other 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 is Other, it, otherwise fradio won't spank you yeah it's not that one uh let's see hold, hold on hold on oh uh, the bmc bmc fantastic Fantastic Halloween Deco Contest. That's the one. Halloween. That ends at midnight nude Britannia time. That's right. Ending October 31st at 11.59.59 p.m. Got to get them in before midnight Halloween. Yes. And uh, two screen up to two screenshots per person. One is determined by the judges and prizes. Eight hundred kodos, four hundred kodos, two hundred kodos, all coming with a mystery prize. And then don't forget to visit the trivia ghost out out in mm. Black Rock Cove. Send in the answers to the trivia ghost questions, and you will be eligible to win yet another prize. The trivia ghost. I like that idea. I really do. Is uh, who trivia. who came up with that, Thradia? Who came up with that idea? The trivia ghost. Uh, don't know. Don't know, but now that we've got some Halloween stuff covered, yes, uh, let's, let's go to the tweet tweeterverse. Out to the tweeterverse. Out to the tweeterverse because horsies are all over the place. Horsies, horsies, horsies. 
because three hours ago, Chris decided that he's changing things gonna up change on how, it. how mounts currently work. Going forward, players will have a movement speed and a mounted speed. The way that buff skills items that impact one, one won't change the other. So we can have things like a special skill or hat that increases mounted speed only. Very cool. I, th I think that was actually to fix the issue with people buffing up and then uh, speeding all the way across the map in like 10 uh, seconds. Or, 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 the, or the issue where the original intention of your riding outfit was supposed to be to give you more speed. Your sailing outfit was supposed to give you more speed sailing. Uh, things of the like that happen that way. But, uh, ooh, Ted and Raiders from Serial Gaming TV joining us here. Thank you. And uh, well, they're, they're, they're going to be just in time because uh, I still haven't pulled that raffle yet. Oh, oh. And don't forget, that's on <clears> both <throat> our streams, twitch.tv slash News and twitch.tv slash Cynicist have raffles going on right now. Oh, no. Exclamation, I love free shit. I'll give those folks a chance to get in before I pull this. Oh, man. I, I, if I if I pulled it on my stream right now, um, Ekondis is going to be really happy. <laughs> Why, is he the only one in? He's the only one in currently. <laughs> um, I, I, I think I should just do it anyway. Just, just to... That, uh, that, that, would, that would mean Ekondis is on fire. I know. He, he, he kind of sh should buy a lottery ticket today at the rate he's going. That's for sure. Yeah. So he, there's a 50 50 chance. No, no Draken, one in 30. 30% chance at, at oh, 40. Uh, 50. Oh, 20% chance now for Econdis to win. 17% uh, hmm. chance or 16? 17%. <laughs> It's yeah, but uh, as people are doing exclamation mark, I love free. I, shit. I'm wondering if that was something that they even remember talking about, or uh, whether uh, just uh, it's one of them. It's easier to do it this way than to mess with all the other systems and just you know add the additional functionality to the mounts that way. Is uh, but uh, yeah, it was supposed to be something tied to your riding outfit uh, with your mounts. Uh, eventually the way i understood it at least uh, that was the buzz and the same it thing was, with the admiral's it was outfits supposed to do so, it was supposed to do something special yes they, they didn't decide what that something special was at that point it was something special it, if, if you, you use if you had your riding outfit on your mount could jump obstacles hmm i don't know maybe uh... yeah <laughs> way to sell some riding outfits get your mounts to jump but uh, anyway, moving right along, we're going to pull this giveaway. We're going to pick ourselves a winner. And Deb Blosick, congrats to you. You are the winner, Mystery Game Key. And I'm, let's I'm see. I'm around on my stream. I've, I've got two cameras on me. Although We've got we've, you a copy a of Overclocked, A History of Violence overclocked a history of violence congratulations to you the blosick go ahead and shout out in game so in, in chat there so i can tag you i don't see you uh recently in chat where i can just tag you easily and then we will go ahead and open up the next giveaway <clears throat> oh man i've got two cameras on me do it a second Excla <clears throat> exclamation i love free shit <clears throat> all right what are we going to talk about next we Is, are uh, going to be talking about some how about a utility hot bar i know everybody would love to have a utility hot bar a utility know. hot bar <clears throat> um let me go find that let me Find, please add the utility hotbar to the deck system. In addition to the combat hotbar, I'd like to be able to set up a different utility hotbar for each deck. 
Decks and varieties, man. Or, Decks or even better than that, is I, I would love to see the fact that we would just have the option like we have in the, uh, <clears throat> in this, this bar, the deck bar, to have an additional, mm -hmm. additional interface like this for the, you know, non-combat deck for this one. So you can have a whole bunch of these. Now, we've covered this several times and... <clears throat> People have asked and asked and asked, can we get more about decks? Can we get more decks? And I believe last Friday, Chris Chris was actually thinking with that on the fly, uh, going above and beyond 24 decks uh, coming up soon. So I'm expecting to see whatever the number is. I'm going to guess he'll try and double that to 48, just because Chris likes to double yeah. things. Um, yeah. That's just my guess. Uh, if 24 hasn't been enough... <clears throat> it's going to be crowd math, and hmm. we're going to end up with the uh, 254. Yeah, uh, you might as well just give us 32,767 slots and let us let us be let us be, you know, and make make it so. <laughs> it, 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 it would be nice. Um, yeah, got all kinds of great things. <clears throat> um, but yes, well, we I, I would like to see that functionality personally. I would like to see an additional. Uh, combat bar you know on the interface so that you could uh, do do with this with this bar you know what we do <clears throat> with this bar when you go into combat because well, you got to be standing to bring that up but you all get the idea i'd like i'd like to have multiple versions of the you know non-combat bar <clears throat> oh, absolutely. I mean, so that way you're doing different things. What, like one would be you're traveling, one you're like uh, Ab absolutely. Farming. One would be farming, uh, one would be traveling, farming, another fishing. Uh, one would be buffs. Of, you know, yeah. What one would be just you know those odds and ends that you use. You know. Um, <clears throat> yep. But but ab absolutely would be nice to see uh, you know be able to have separate versions of that as well. So. Uh, just a little nudge, nudge out there for the development team. Nudge, nudge, nudge. Yeah, nudge, nudge. nudge. It, it, is it time for me to click on that close giveaway button? I believe it is. It, I don't know it, if it, you it, feel it, like doing so. I, it's I did your, it, your choice. And, uh, Dr. Uh, Dr. D? Dr. D. Oops. Has I'm sorry, folks. One. You're all going to have to rejoin that giveaway. I forgot oh, I had you... already reopened it. Did, no, did well, it? I, I, I reset it right after I picked, and I didn't realize that I did that, and people had already entered the next one, and I just reset okay. that. So everybody who was in on the reset needs to get back in again. That's all. And, you all got to type it again. Me, you got the, you, I, I gave you the free chip uh, already. Uh, mm. You won yourself a copy of looter kings um so that to is a steam code for looter. azazel reborn you can actually do that dude um awesome. i believe i actually have that uh, built in on this one um yeah i i can seed water in combat um yeah i've, I've got that already built into my combat bar here <laughs> uh you you can put that in combat to make yourself go a little faster on those uh, debuff slowdowns, uh, whatever you want to call them. But, uh, yes. you know, while you're waiting for it on your utility bar, when you have it in your combat bar and you have a five stack, like, you know, you, you can actually move it a little faster that way. So you can actually put that on your combat bar. You can't add seeds to the combat bar. Let me see this. Let me see this. Uh, let's pull up our skills window. Let's go to crafting, agriculture. And Where is are it? you testing uh, Azazel's uh, comment? Ordering plants. You can't, you sow can't seed, seed bonus. To, on harvest. The part. I haven't farmed in a long time. Ignore the fact that I have uh, glass houses on my lot. You're welcome, Dr. D. Um, and see, I could have sworn I had this on the combat bar. So I can put the other two on there, but I can't put that one. 
Let's see. I, I don't. Why am I receiving work messages uh, right now? Let's do this oh, the other way. Let's go this way. If I deck. Uh, Any good if. Yeah, drag the seeds themselves. Order plants, harvest plants, and the agriculture. Oh, interesting. So it's not there. I could have sworn I, I had done it. I, I've done lots of things that uh, I can't remember doing. Say that. Okay. Oh yeah. What about yeah? What about that? Uh, I hadn't. That, I, maybe that's what I did. I actually dragged the seeds themselves and put the seed actually in the combat bar. I forget. I don't have any yes. seeds on me. Do I have any seeds? I do not have any seeds. On I, me I think I think that's what it was. You put the seeds actually in the bar. But again, I don't have them to try. I believe that's how I did it. But uh, I know these other two I had in the combat in the combat bar to move them, the watering and harvesting as well. So interestingly enough, uh, you guys should then be either bugging that or putting that in as a uh, wish list item if it's you know. But I would bug that. Econdus, bug report, I please. Have, I have a so so Coswold. I have a keep lot that has I think nine or eleven greenhouses on it, completely filled with planters. I have I haven't used it. <laughs> sitting empty. It's I sitting I empty. I have a keep lot one third filled with just plain planters because twenty items per planter no no longer allows you to fill a keep lot full of planters, which yeah. really sucks. Yeah. Yeah. Is uh. Mm. But yes, uh, so we also have a request um, out on the forums for the community rules and guidelines to be linked in the daily message. Can we get the community rules and guidelines linked? And let's see if I can scroll back here because... because yeah. We are so worried about in, in this game about naming things after the coronavirus that it's a bannable offense. Um Yeah. As, as well as uh, naming your character after anything that's been trademarked, um, which I, uh. I think is pretty funny because you mean like Atos? <clears throat> Someone, <laughs> Chris, um, uses a character that is a trademark name, uh. which I think is hilarious. That Lazarus song, no. That's yeah, not trademark. Yeah. No, no, well, no, no. I wasn't even <laughs> referring to you. I was referring to Bilbo. Bil Bilbo, yeah. Well, I know. There's, there's, there's so yeah, many of yeah. them. It's ridiculous. The developer himself uses a character it, named Bilbo. Is uh, that's trademark right there? It's like, uh, but but the community events page is here, and the community guidelines. So isn't that community rules and guidelines? Yeah, it's it's it is there. What are they What are they talking about? It is there. So why why are they asking for it? It's been there, but under the pet thing for all this time. Community guidelines. Well, no, he wants it as the daily message when you log into the game, though. It is there. That's what I'm telling you. Well, th th that that's because if you scroll down a little bit, done. I added the link to the COVID message. Oh, okay. I, I've thought it's been there the whole time, personally. No, it is no. there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, uh, it was just added. But uh, yeah, yeah. So it is there now. So, so does that mean I could, you know, make make fun of like the flu or SARS or anything else, just as long as it's Influenza, not COVID? It, as long as it's not SARS. As long, COVID, COVID as, long as it's not COVID nineteen. That is correct. It's fair you game. Are fine. Yes, uh, you can make fun of the common cold. Um, as much as you want. Hat to. Chew. Influence, influenza A, influenza B, influenza C, swine flu, bird flu, H N H one N one. You can make fun of them all. There we go. Uh, gotta get a name. Gotta name a pig swine flu. Gonna na name a chicken bird flu. That's correct. N name that a cow. Name a cow mad cow. Uh, <laughs> the, yes, you need to do all those things. Okay. Make fun of a player with the name Itchy Butt. <laughs> yep. 
Hey, Condis, you know, we got to be us. That's right. Hold you on know. for just a second. Someone wants to ask me a question. Does, uh... Oh, someone wants to answer you. Hi, Heather. <clears throat> or maybe it's not Heather. I don't know. <laughs> we shall see. Red Dragon, uh, again, there, there is uh, several of those that people have them. People have the name Lord This, Lord That. People have the name Duke This, Duke That. And uh, e even though, uh, according to the rules, any of the titles that we have in game, what is the titles list? I guess I have to come up here and look at it. What is the, oh, I don't have a shortcut key for it. But supposedly you're not supposed to be able to use any of these names. And uh, if for some of you people who didn't know that there is a long list of titles that are achievable or were purchasable. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, something. But uh, Royal <coughs> is something you're supposed to not be able to use. Lord, you're not supposed to be able to use. Knight, you're not supposed to be able to use. Uh, Duke, you're not supposed to be able to use. Count, you're not supposed to be able to use. Baron, you're not supposed to be able to use. You're not supposed to be able to use Sir. any of these as a game Sir. name. So Yeah. Sir? Yes. Lord. Um, yeah. Pilgrim. A Pilgrim. Yeah. But you're not supposed to associate those into your names, and you know what? I, I really don't have a problem with it, uh, because we have plenty of people uh, out there who, uh, you know, I used to work with a guy that his first name was Colonel. Yeah, yeah. A and uh, one of my former students was Major. I, I, I've known uh, a couple of guys named Duke, you know, I mean, so, yeah. You know, I mean, it's, it's just... It's like, <clears throat> this is my name. Allow it to me. I, the difference is you're already segregating out the fact that you've got different colors for titles as well as for names. So do something special. Yes, and I, I hadn't refreshed that because I didn't... Uh, uh, I didn't. <laughs> oh, how about the plague? Yes, you can do that. And I'm, I'm resetting my giveaway right now and clicking open. So that way everybody can do exclamation mark. I love free shit on my stream. Oh, yes. Thank you. Oh, God. yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, But yes, El Elgarian did add that daily that daily message on there um oh you really want to stir this shit with this post don't you who uh, oh, me <clears throat> shit it, stir it, lies it, it, it's really Troll not forms it, it's really not as bad and i've been holding this for a day where you are actually here with us because you know yeah Laz trolling uh, oh, the forum. Oh, only, only you for, could read this as it needs to be read. <laughs> okay, so uh, now that I, I I've noticed this. Okay, so good morning. I wanted to discuss or bring up a point my friend was who just started playing. Asking for a friend. It seems the Asking only gear friend. worth getting is only found in the crafting mechanic. It doesn't appear to him, at least. There are many good drops. The good gear that drops is in the form of artifacts, which require a painfully inconvenient way to upgrade them. This makes me not want to bother getting an artifact, because using another artifact to salvage seems like a hug pain. Hug pain. Huge. Hug pain. Huge. Yes. Huge hug. Here is my suggestion to... Fix the issue of players who don't want to craft. Players who want to be able to find named or rare monsters to ca camp them for chances at good loot. One. Should I, should I stop you there or should I let you continue? I'll let you continue. There needs to be adequate gear drops for people who don't want to shell out the for the overpriced items people are selling. Artifacts should either not need to be repaired or the repair process should be the same at least because consistency does not exist. Remember the days you could find loot before the non-popular mechanics of item repair were introduced? Think EverQuest. Dude, think you owe, man. 
Where's my vanquishing halberd that I blessed? Um, that everybody it, had. <laughs> that everybody had. Then, then well, again, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell this guy that we're not wow right off the bat. But continue on. It mind sounds like too much of an extreme change of for artifacts, but let the best gear in the game be be repairable. But this game needs good droppable items, which is lacking. This would be the fastest way to add new loot to the game by improving items already here. That's my friend's biggest complaint. He isn't aware what he is working for. With EverQuest, you knew you were working towards leveling to get to a higher dungeon, so you can camp uh, items. From named, yeah, you can camp named champs for rare items worth having. So basically what he's saying is, I want to be able to go camp, which we don't want you to do in this game, so that I can get the rare loot at the next level that everybody else in the game has got because... <laughs> Other Continue. than my friend's point, all is well. Interesting loot, good weapons with proc effects or examples of exciting loot. So if we can add named mobs and with some gear worthy of getting, that would be awesome. It's very important for players to feel like they are getting more powerful, and the skills and spells alone don't really do a good job of showing you get stronger. Perhaps the level spread is just really broad. It seems like the game is hard enough to allow for some better gear to be... Thanks for listening. Well, uh, we, we, we've we known this for a very long time. Blue tables suck abysmally. Um, well, next, next post one... real quick. Next post real quick. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and yes... Some of us miss the days of camping rare mobs and loot with friends. That's right. All MMORPGs have now is either you just being run through a dungeon or for loot or crafted. Nothing for the traditional camper of items. Getting rare math for good gear isn't all that much incentive for many who want, just want to drop that's decent or with exciting properties. Dude, go get a cowbell, man. Get a go cowbell. Go find a cowbell. Or and the, yeah, and, go and, look and, at the loot drop. And, and the next, the next, next, the next, next post, which is a uh, chuckle. It's getting fixed. Chris said, "Twenty twenty two twenty would be the year loot doesn't suck." <laughs> uh, Any, anyway, is uh, I I and again I I can understand what he's asking for there, but uh, again. Um, you're asking for what a lot of games, including this one, have gotten away from. Now, back in the day, it might have been great sitting around. And if you if you want to do that here, actually, you can. You can go camp the Queen Spider for the Silk Belt. You can go camp the Reapers for the Cowbell. You, but that's how yeah. you're going to get that rare loot is camping those champs. So, and, and that those are also classified as artifacts. The thing that yeah. pisses me off about the like. Um, the gear in this game, the most powerful gear was supposed to be player crafted. That was by design. Unfortunately, artifacts completely superseded that, although you can I make disagree modifications with that because to artifacts, which makes them crafted. I, I will items. I will tell you. Let me let me pull up my loadout. Yeah. On my uh, loadout, on my paper doll, I I think I have one artifact, which is the Ring of Cuddlekin for jumping. Otherwise, everything is player crafted. Um, I personally don't see artifacts as being worth their while for just about anything because 99.99999% well, of the time, their debuff or their downside is totally adverse to what I want a you know, buff to be. So if I'm looking to get an extra intelligence buff, I don't want my strength to drop because I want an intelligence buff. I need an intelligence buff on top of the strength and shit I've already got. So I'm not willing yeah. to make a lot of those trade-offs. Uh, and and, and you know. realistically, the repair game and the break-in gear game in this game sucks. Uh, I mean, gear hardly ever breaks, and it like it should break, break. Um, if your durability gets down to zero, that item should be completely, like, now the only the only times I do, and again I do have you know several different builds, but like when I'm out mining, when I'm out mining, then yes I've got on 
my gauntlets of lead to give me some interesting extra effects. I've got on the BMC ring to give me some additional effects. And, <clears throat> um, yeah, well, the belt of control, that's for my taming. But I use, I use that belt in my taming build. Um, you know, otherwise, in my normal everyday build, again, I use an artifact. And that's just so I can carry more equipment. Um, under just, uh, come on, where's, why aren't you uh, going and equipping my... Here we go. Um, I use the BMC ring um, in conjunction with the Ring of Brittle Brawn to give me an insanely amount of carry. And wh why are you going so... <clears throat> why am I going so what? I was stuttering for a second. Did your internet connection go bye-bye or was <clears throat> it mine? Um, no, mine probably just stuttered for a second because I saw yeah, a really big lag spike. Really bad on my <clears throat> yeah, my my internet's uh, getting a little little wonky internet over here. Hook. Yeah, do the reboot. Yeah, that's right. Seven midnights, and don't forget, everybody! Exclamation mark! I love free shit on both streams, so that way yep. you can get some free shit. Unless something blue screens in the middle of the show might happen on his side this today. But like me getting booted from game just now? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. well. Pelican, network congestion. <laughs> yeah, as you, you all heard, it, whenever that robot voice happens, someone's having internet connection issues sometimes, most of the time. Because it's all my stuff. fault. All yeah. my fault. Treasure anyway. File, treasure file, not your fault this time. Let's jump over to that NBN and chat at the Avatar community calendar. Oh. Hosted on nbnn.info, just click on the calendar button and you too can look at this aggregated mess of all the Google public calendars related to Shroud that that guy knows about. All times on the community calendar are central time in the real world, but we prefer to refer to it as nude Britannia nude time. Nude Britannia time. And where should you send your nudes? Nudes at nbnn.info. So we can carefully curate those two, two minutes. minutes at a time. Yes. Yes, part of game design is based off of psychology and keeping people happy. Uh, I, I loved how someone yesterday actually said, I now understand Jack's crafting challenge. Oh, there are several people commenting on that here in Discord. Uh, you know, because, yeah. yes, uh, and it's not just you know the one crafting school because they were crafting something totally different from what you were issued as a challenge they were doing booze which is just as challenging because first you got to do your casks and harvesting all the material to build those casks is a feat into itself hey, then man. you have to gather all the materials to brew and, and then you, th then you fuck it up because you pick up that cask that you started that t that 10 year whiskey uh, yes, I am hacking Laz to make him sound like Max Headroom. Um, yes. Uh, no, I'm not. Um, he's downloading porn right now, that's why. Um, oh, wait. Which camera are we on? Oh, we're on this camera. Gotta listen to the good stream. Um, but yes, uh, all, all times uh, on the community calendar are Central Time in the Real World. Uh, Monday through Friday, 12s and 6s around the clock. You should tune in your ether amplifiers to Wadia Radio Free Britannia. Mm -hmm. Listen to two idiots interpreting the news so you don't have to. A little show called Lunch with me. With us. Uh, at 7 p.m. this evening on WRFB is the 70s at 7. That is followed at 8 o'clock on Virtue Radio by the Beat of Novia with Aline Dragonfire. At 8 on WRFB is The Outlanders with Parson Barr and Vassler. And at 10 p.m. on WRFB is The Wekud Womb with Wes's Wed, where he covers some walk and wool history from 1946 to 1974. Indeed. Don't forget to listen to WRFB while you're out there. And Avatar's update number 402 has been released already oh well yeah of course they wait till the did, end of our show to release email? it uh no i just saw it pop up on steam oh, yeah okay. 
Chris is cheap. That's why we don't get emails. He he admitted to that last week or the week before. <laughs> yeah. Twilight Tempest. Here's a name I haven't seen in a while. What's up, girl? How are you? How are you? Get it, get in on the action. But yes, you're tuned in to Lunch with Laz and Jack right here on NBNN. Don Info, twitch.tv slash, and it says twitch.tv slash NBNN News. Catching us in replays on YouTube and or Twitch. You're listening in WRFB Radio Free Britannia. We love you all, no matter how you listen to our show. We do appreciate it. Thanks to viewers like you. You've kept us here five and a half plus, going on six years. Uh, we'll be turning turning that corner soon enough here, as soon as 2020 gets the hell out of here, that's for sure. As, uh, but anyway, as, uh, thanks to you guys uh, keeping us here. We do appreciate it. Bits, we love those bits. Make this uh, make that thing move. Uh, helps keep us here. Helps pay for all the good stuff we do. The Britannia Mining Company wants you to check out Black Rock Cove, located in the Quell region near the town of Exeter and conveniently located near the mines that you want to be near. Black Rock Cove's got everything you need for your crafting goods. And, of course, at Rock Bottom Guild Pricing, consult the price guide down below here as well. This price guide, not that. It's this, not that. And uh, check out the latest guild pricing out at Black Rock Cove. So check them out. WRFB Radio Free Britannia bringing you the latest news and entertainment 24-7 around the clock. <laughs> Make it look like you got a real office. There you go. <clears throat> playing with those zoom oh, backgrounds that, that, that's the couch man is that the, that's the casting couch right yeah <laughs> i don't know what you're talking about that's just my couch <laughs> randy cooper just yeah, subscribe thank you randy so I, I i may have that <clears throat> as a uh zoom background <laughs> jobmusic.com for your abc file needs randy give us a track number i don't see randy there oh, oh. What, what did he send you uh, it says follow. It said followed and subscribed. I just sworn that uh, came well, up that, as a subscribe. Subscribe on YouTube. Ah, okay. That's on YouTube, no, no, no track for that, man. No, no track, track for that. Yeah, I got to get over here and look at it. Yes. But yes, Caffius is wares on shroudmarketplace.com. Caffius got all your wood goods that you need for uh your crafting inside ah randy cooper equals bridge troll and it was youtube yes thank you thank you thank you thank don't, you don't forget to subscribe to my only fans and he followed yeah that's right <clears throat> kathy has got all your wood goods that you need out at trout and .com. and of course shroud and marketplace is the place to go for all your virtual vendable goods Inside Shroud of the Avatar, if you're looking for everything and anything Shroud of the Avatar related, Shroud Marketplace is the place to go to get all that cool stuff. That's right. ShroudMarketplace.com is the place to go buy or sell anything Shroud of the Avatar related. Just need to register an account to buy anything. And if you want to start selling your stuff, you click on vendor registration on the left -hand side. Anything and everything Shroud related can be bought or sold at ShroudMarketplace.com. That goes well, for accounts, game gold, all the way to services. As long as it's not a bannable offense, you can buy it or sell it at ShroudMarketplace.com. As long as it's not named COVID. Yeah, yeah, it can't be named COVID. But anything and everything, including some of our favorite services from Deco services, leveling services, moms, or refining service, because she's the patron saint of lazy avatars. Hi, Lily. Nice of you to join me today. Lily, well, you making a cat meow? Why did you jump jump up on my mouse? Because um, she's chasing mice. I can't scroll ice. right now because Lily is on. <laughs> Come, here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, so now I can scroll again. Um, anything and everything, including services. Um, I need to click on services. Moms, the patron saint of lazy avatars, you've spent all that time out in the mines getting that ore, and you want someone to convert it to ingots. You know what? Contact mom. She'll do it for you. Pay her that nominal fee. And she'll take your ore. She'll grab a massive pile of coke, and then she'll be like, hi, how's it going? And then she'll return with a bunch of ingots shortly after that. 
but anything and everything, including weddings and more. I last. That's right, because it's not just weddings, it's a whole lot more. Come visit my shop on Trap Marketplace if you're looking to get hitched, because I've got everything you need. Custom vows, custom lot setup, extra attire for the bridal party, you name it, we've got it. And of course, if you're looking for telethon rares, and I'm talking about some way back rares, we've got them out there. Want to buy a duck? Come see me. Need more cowbell? We've got it. Bulk granite, bulk ore, bulk suet, all available on my shop and more at shroudmarketplace.com. And of course, 200 shop. plus shops. Yeah, 200 plus shops. Go visit Jack's shop. Jack's got some cool, cool property for I don't know if I want to say cheap price, but cheaper than original, originally priced. Oh, man. <laughs> cheaper than I bought it for. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I can't argue. I picked up some property the other day really cheap, so I'm not arguing. Yeah. I'm not yeah, arguing. Yeah. There's some good deals to be had out there in the world. And, of course, you just got to be out there shopping and looking for them. How do we out there shopping and looking for him? Lily's uh, tail, so. And Lily is mm. on the edge of my chair. Very cool. Like, yeah. But that's going to be about it for us for today. It's a fruck awesome Friday. Time for us to wrap things up and get out of here. You, of course. You know we need to close giveaway. I was just going to tell them we got last chance to do that as we get ready to go raid Skeggy Media. You know what? <clears throat> I, I just pulled on Gorix. Gorix, congratulations. And Gorix is getting a copy of Devil's Hunt. And Tina was the last person to get in. Good for you. Now I gotta go find Gorix in here. So that way. Picking our winner. Click on that and then send him his key. Plum. So Gorix, congratulations. You missed it. That. Jigoku, and... congratulations. You are the winner. Let's see what Jigoku's got a copy of. As we get on out here, and Jigoku's gonna get themselves a copy of Rad Rogers Radical Edition. Rad Rogers Radical Edition. Congratulations, yeah. Devil's Jigoku. So I, I gave away over thirty dollars worth of games today. Wait, I'm sure we gave away quite a bit. I didn't even look at any of the prices of today's games because just. You got distracted. That's that's okay. Girl. Congratulations Girl. to everybody that won. Thank you for everything that you did, and thank you for watching. Well, let's look. Like let's it. just look what Rad Rogers was worth out there. Rad Rogers on Steam. That guy is last. We're gonna be raiding Skeggy Media real soon. Nineteen ninety nine. Not bad. <laughs> Bridge Troll, you're terrible. That's right. We're going to be getting out of here. I'm Laz. He's Jack. We are in the uh, NN. I, I don't see Skeggy streaming right now. I do. What the fuck, man? Refresh. Refresh. Oh, there, there he is. There, there he is. <laughs> All right. We're out of here. You guys and gals, have a great weekend. We'll be back with more on Monday right here on NBN. Until then. I'm Laz. I'm Jack. And we are in VNN. Have a great weekend, everybody. We'll see you all on Monday.